I'm Ann Chai, a master chocolatier for Lint USA. Hi, I'm Jason Smith from Steak 954 at the W Hotel in Fort Lauderdale. And today we're going to prepare a wonderful dish for you. It's a savory dish using Lint chocolate. Yes, I'm going to take a, a slow cooked uh, beef short rib and add a little uh, intense orange chocolate with uh, some sort of a, a mole inspiration of spices. Ancho chilies, uh, nutmeg, cloves, allspice, uh, star anise, a little cinnamon, little almonds, and uh, a little parsnip puree. Uh, I'm gonna start with a couple pinches of, of salt and pepper here for this, this beef short rib. I use a, a canola and a olive oil blend. I wanna saute this for a minute. Uh, you get that nice and seared off. Use all those juices that are still in there. I got one onion, one carrot, and two stalks of celery. And then I'm gonna add a good Cabernet. I reduced the, the red wine here a bit, so I'm gonna add a little bit of veal stock. Two cinnamon sticks. Six allspice, two star anise, six cloves, handful of thyme, a couple bay leaves, and some chili. Some of this lint orange chocolate in there. Let that reduce down. And we're gonna have a sauce here soon. You know, Jason, I'm really passionate about the history of chocolate, and I'm, I'm sure you know that, that chocolate was used back in Mexico by the Aztecs and okay. the Mayans, and uh, their chocolate was savory. A lot of people don't know that, but it was a, a drink, and it was perfumed with chili and spices, mm. but they didn't know sugar, they didn't have sugar. So I think this is really neat how you're taking it into that, that whole retro vibe of the, the savory sauce. At this point, uh, my sauce is done, so I'm going to take this piece of beef short rib and put it in this larger pot. Add this braising liquid over the top. Put a lid on it and then slow cook it for about two hours. Okay, we're gonna make the, uh, the final plate here. Uh, I made a little bit of, of a parsnip puree with uh, parsnips and milk mm -hmm. cooked down and then pureed. I'm gonna add a little bit of that to the plate. Make a nice little little design. And then I'm gonna place our finished product. Oh, that is gorgeous. Looks like chocolate, doesn't it? It does. A little bit of sauce on there. And then we're gonna top it off with a salad. Chive batons, celery sprouts. A pinch of salt to that. A little touch of extra virgin olive oil. Finish it with some toasted almonds. And here we have our, our finished plate. It's a braised beef short rib, a little sweet, a little savory, good use of chocolate and spices. Easy, very easy to do at home. Jason, this looks absolutely delicious. Thank you. Thank you for showing us another way to incorporate lint chocolate into the unexpected. Something, something savory and delicious. I had a lot of fun, thank you. Learn how to make a delicious chocolatey treat at home. Watch You Be the Chef. Go to On Demand, get local, Everything Chocolate.